In this video, we're going to talk about color space warnings and how to convert images from one color space to another. So when submitting images to Zook binders for design or spreads for print to bind, the JPEGs need to be in sRGB color space. And if you're not, if they're not, you'll see a warning like this. And frequently, uh, for design, print, and bind, the image that's not sRGB is an image uploaded for a cover, so like a cameo or a photo to go on a leather spine uh, album. In Photoshop or InDesign, you can start off with a spread as an SR in the sRGB color space. Additionally, you can batch images to that color space. And design services uh, software like Fundy or AlbumStomp, you can export the spreads as sRGB. So very frequently, it's not the spreads, it's another image that you may have cropped and uploaded. So I'm gonna go into Bridge. And I've got my five by seven I cropped for a cameo. And I can see in the metadata here that it is Adobe sRGB. The original is sRGB, as are all the other images. So this, the, the problem is if I uploaded this to my job, this is causing the error message in Zookie Pro. So how to change that? I'm gonna open up that image in Photoshop. And you can convert the color profile by going to Edit, Convert to Profile. It'll show you the source, the actual image is Adobe RGB 1998. And my destination space, I want it to be sRGB. Now there's lots of options here, and you don't want any of them. But you want to pick the sRGB, and then hit OK. Now, oh, and then we want to save. Now, when we look at the image in Bridge, it is the 5x7 in sRGB. And if you're familiar with how to run actions in Photoshop, you could create an action to convert a bunch of images uh, into sRG from any color profile to any other color profile. If you're not familiar with how to run a batch, you can check that out at adobe.com. They have wonderful tutorials. But that is how to uh, look and see what the color profile is of your image and how to convert it to sRGB in Photoshop.